You will be given one table to use in the prep room. You must do all of your prep on this table when you are not actively using the stove or other equipment provided by the contest organizers. When you finish the prep work, clean and clear your prep table. This table will then go with you into the demonstration room and be used as your front table for the demonstration. It will be carefully carried by two adults. You can carry your posters and pick up any supplies that may fall off your table when it's being carried into the demonstration room. Your theme elements and tablecloths should be on the front of the table. These items should not interfere with your demonstration or block the judge's view. You don't need to show every step of your recipe during your demonstration. Choose two or three steps to highlight for your audience and have the other steps prepped ahead of time. For example, you can have a tray of pre-measured ingredients waiting on the back table for you to bring to the front of the table when you are ready to use them in your demonstration. Leave heavy or awkward pieces of equipment off to the side of the table so that you won't risk dropping them. If your recipe calls for a certain technique, such as separating egg whites from yolks, beating egg whites to peaks, tempering yolks, or using a water bath, it's a good idea to show that step in your demonstration. On the back table, keep your finished dish ready and waiting for you to present and serve to the judges. If you're serving a dish like an omelet or a fried egg that is cooked in front of the judges, time your demonstration to end just as your dish finishes cooking so it can be served warm to the judges.